Hello, is this the Army Careers Office? Yes, it is. How can I help you? I am thinking that I might like to join the Army. Well, you have come to the right place. That's good. My only concern is that I do have a bit of a spare tire around my waist. Yes, I see. You are a little bit of a tubby bitch, aren't you? Can you run, or do you tend to wobble a lot? I have chased the ice cream van few times. And I have caught it, but as well as having a bit of a belly, I do have a mean set of top bollocks on me. Why do you want to join the army? Well, to be honest I love the cop. I thought joining the army would mean I lose some weight and that with lots of men around, they would like to fuck me. Okay, I see. Can I make a suggestion? Have you thought about joining the NAFI? What's the NAFI? It is the Navy, Army and Air Force Institute. They have small shops in the barracks where soldiers can buy overpriced items that they can usually buy five minutes down the road for the half the price, but can't be asked to leave the barracks. They also have a bar where some of the soldiers will get drunk in the evening and play traditional army games, such as Dance of the Flaming Assholes, and who can fit the most loose change in their foreskin. How drunk do they get? I normally target drunken men because of my weight. But then I find they usually pass out while they are going down on me. Soldiers are highly trained men. They are trained by their superiors in professionalism and the art of modern warfare. Once they join their battalion or unit, they are trained by the senior privates and junior non-commissioned officers in the other skills that a soldier needs to function. These cover heavy drinking sessions, pints made up from the spirits on the top shelf, fighting and mostly importantly pulling and nailing fat chicks, like yourself. Surely their performance must be affected by the alcohol? No, soldiers are well practiced in carrying out various duties under the influence. Many soldiers get so hammered on a night out that the next day at first parade they have more alcohol in their system than your mother had the night she lost her virginity. I myself have seen men go out drinking, return to camp and then go out 30 minutes later on a rehearsal of trooping the color without so much as a coffee, let alone any sleep. It sounds like I shouldn't have a problem in getting laid then. Are soldiers adventurous in the sack? I once had sex on my period and if you buy me a couple of cheeky vim toes I might let you finger my fat sweaty ass. Yes, soldiers pride themselves in gaining their red and brown wings. You will even find men that will go down on you when you have your period, but for that I'd suggest you try to get posted to one of the parachute battalions. Would they want to do it in my room or theirs? A drunken soldier does not care where sex take place. The bin area behind the local nightclub has always been a big favorite, but soldiers are taught to be flexible. Won't there be other girls working in the NAFI? Yes there will, maybe three or four. But some of the women there may be married, others will refuse the soldiers' advances, there may even be a male working there. You may find that you are the only one that puts out. Will then they see me as a slut? No, you will be known as a 2AM princess. The amount of alcohol a soldier drinks, he won't care who you've slept with before. He probably won't care if his mate stood behind him about to put his cock in your mouth. It sounds like the perfect job then. I think for a chubby slut like yourself, it's the ideal role. But I must warn you. Men will see you as a naffy girl, because of your blubber they will target you. Some of these men are experienced in trapping naffy girls and more so they're highly qualified in shafting big birds like yourself. But the rewards are high, with all the gangsters pasties and cock you can eat. I think it's perfect. Thank you and I shall go and join the naffy. I'm glad I could be of assistance. I hope you get the job you want. Oh, and one more thing. Do your fancy a quick fuck before you go.